Alright, what's going on guys? Back again today with another episode. An exciting thing has happened. Legendary chest. So I'm going to start off the episode. I'm going to buy this. I'm hoping for something good. I hope it's a hound. Please be a hound. I have my eyes closed. What is it? Oh, a bandit! Nice! Nice, my dog. Super excited. Um, yeah, nice. I just think I think I just got to the arena where I could unlock it. I'm going to take a screenshot of this. Nice. We're going to show you some bandit gameplay then eventually. Not today. Probably not today. Today we're focused on our other legendary, the miner. So again, this is the deck that I made a while ago. I've been playing around with. Um, two legendaries, the log and the miner. And it's really just a cheap uh, chip cycle deck. So as you can see, I have played three times with it. And I've won all three times. What was that loss? That was a prince challenge. That's what that was. Okay. Um, so I'm going to show you a replay. Um, I hate Elite Barb, so let's watch this one. Because I managed to beat an Elite Barb deck. So I'm going to show you this. Uh, it's kind of zap bait, uh, zap baity, I guess, um, with a bunch of stuff that you can zap. I'm just going to speed. No, we're not. We're going to relax and watch it. So this is Neo Chevrolet uh, from Titans Ecuador. Um, again, running an E-Barb Hog deck. Um, and I decide, hey, I'm going to start with my Miner, and I'm going to drop my Skarmy. I hope. Am I, or what? Hmm, that was weird. <laughs> it took me a while to drop that. And he didn't zap me. So that was sick. Uh, his prince is over there, so I'm going to air all that, get some good value. And then he does decide to zap my Skarmy. I'm going to throw him a barrel because he just zapped. So here we go. Doesn't want to waste his fireball. He'll drop a knight. I'll get some good chip damage. There we go. He says, oops. I'm like, I don't really care. I'm doing fine. Uh, and then he's going to drop his e-barbs with this. I was like, ah, oh, okay. So I drop my wizard over here. And then my goblin gank just to splash everything. And this ends up working really well. He'll fireball, but I, he misses pretty much everything. So I'm like, okay, I I'm going to push. He must be low on elixir. Um, and I put my miner in there to tank for my wizard. And I do manage to get some good damage done. Um, he does not drop his princess. Probably a good idea because I would log him. I have my log in my hand, and we're gonna take a sizable advantage after that misfire ball. Uh, really punishing. We really punish him after that misfire ball. I say thanks because I think that he meant that. Um, I have my Skarmy. He's gonna zap it, um, but then I'm gonna kind of leave it and counter push, which maybe isn't the greatest idea. Um, and he's gonna do all that, and then I arrow pretty much everything, so I get the king tower too. I hope I do. Um, so that's a good value arrow. Again, if the king tower is activated, you may as well arrow it. Um, and then we're pretty much just going to see the rest of the game out. So again, 10.30, we know you have to be careful because of the, um, the hog. But the elite barbs having trouble with that much. I'm running high on elixir here. I'm going to drop my wizard. Or I'm going to waste a little bit of elixir. Good play. Mm. Um, he's going to try and fireball this. I think he hits it this time. Good for him. He does manage to hit it. Uh, but I have my gang up, so I'm going to gang tank in the corner. The word of the day, gang tank. And I drop my miner in the back there. Just to clean this up a little bit. He's going to get some good chip damage. I'm going to drop some minions just to stop that. And he's going to zap, but by that time, he's not going to zap. His zap is out of rotation because he zapped my, he zapped my um, wizard to get rid of that. So, yeah, he might have been able to take my tower had he not zapped. But instead, he's elected to get rid of the wizard, which is fine by me. I drop another wizard. He has another fireball ready. But I have another gang. This time I drop it right on top. And he decides he's going to zap the gang, um, which isn't great because my minion horde can just tank for my, um, my minion horde can tank for my wizard. And then I get my miner in here, throw another barrel. My wizard's still hanging out with a little bit of life. It's going to get some good chip damage. Um, I'm going to throw my Skarmy down in front of this, and again, doesn't have a zap ready. He'll fireball, um, but he will miss a lot of the Skarmy, and that means I'll be able to take it as knight. And that means I can drop my wizard safely. Um, he's gonna zap it. I don't know why, but whatever. Uh, he says crying face, and I'm gonna win the game. So, nice comprehensive victory there as my log slowly rolls in sarcastically with the arrows. And we take a one crown and no victory. So that's pretty much the basics of the deck. Just a chip deck, keep people on their heels, um, and punish them for mistakes such as, you know, missing fireballs and getting greedy with fireballs, stuff like that. So that's the deck again. Goblin Gang, two legendaries, minor, and log. I clicked those in the wrong order, but that's okay. Um, one epic, Goblin Barrel. And the rest, pretty much everybody should have two epics. I lied, Skarmy. Two legendary, two epics, one rare, and three common. So, again, good coverage deck. We're going to jump right in. I haven't lost it yet. I'm sure I'm going to lose with it this video, but whatever. I bought the bandit, so I can't really restart, but whatever. We're going to play Khalil from the Pharisee clan, and then he's going to be level 10. So, that's, that's ugly. I'm going to start with my miner. Let's see how he's going to deal with my miner here. And we're going to get some nice light swing. Ooh, he's going to ignore it. I should have barreled. I'm still going to barrel. So I have my Skarmy and a bunch of defensive cards. 
If my miner can tank just a little bit longer. Now he has to drop his Valkyrie. Okay. All right, so I managed to get him to split up his push a little bit. And that means because maybe he doesn't have his Valkyrie, I can use my Skyrimi. So I'm going to drop it fairly early just in case he does have... Oh, like that. That's kind of annoying. But he zapped, though, so that was questionable. Uh, I'm going to log this back a little bit of separation. Um, he's going to get some good damage, unfortunately. He's going to get some very good damage. But we're going to get some damage on the far side, too. But he might take out our tower here. He came close to taking our tower. I'm going to barrel this. I uh, might have wanted to minor, but that's okay. I need to save the elixir for this wizard that I'm going to use to defend the baby dragon. That tower is pretty low. If he has any spells, that tower is going down. So we made a little bit of an overcommitment. It's going to be difficult to stop. Um, it's going to be difficult to stop that giant, but whatever. Uh, I'm going to drop my miner way in the back. Would have been better if it got there a little bit earlier, but I didn't know he was dropping out that pump. So we're going to chip that pump down. For three elixir, it's a fairly good trade. He only got one. Uh, one pump through that, he'll get probably one or two more, so not bad if he's going to pump up. Um, but we did take a lot of life off it for three elixir. Going to drop my my minions on these, uh, Valkyrie. No, 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 Okay, it's going to take out the tower. He's going to do this. I'm going to do this. He's probably going to wizard. Yep. It's a little bit distracted. I'm going to get some good chip damage, though. That's going to be some nice chip damage. That's Oh, we're going to chip that tower out. Nice. There we go. That's not bad. Um, I'm going to do this and then hopefully send my miner in the back here to create a little bit of separation. There we go. That's not bad. And now if I have to, I can drop my Skarmy. I'm going to have to drop my Skarmy. Oh, that's ugly. That's okay. We're going to get some, we're going to shut that down fairly decently. No, we're not. Oh, get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Oh, Lord. This is not going very well. Nice, we're going to lose that tower. Uh, I need to start pushing. We're in the double elixir. He's going to drop a Valkyrie. I'm going to ignore that because right now I can't really afford to uh, deal with that. So I'm going to do this. Oh, well, I have to deal with that, though. But we're going to get a push down here. Hopefully my minions can tank. I, what? Where are you going? Oh, my God. And I'm pretty sure this is going to be a good game because, dang, he had a lot of stuff to deal with my chip. And I couldn't get anything going. Stop. Where's my minions? Stop. I'm going to say good game, and we're going to lose my for the first time with this deck, but I mean, eh. That is a somewhat difficult deck to deal with. He had cameras for almost all my guards, but that's eh, whatever. It's a learning curve. Um, So yeah, there's decks it struggles against. I haven't played a giant deck in a while, so that was kind of interesting. Um, But yeah, definitely something I may need to change is kind of to put a heavier hitting card in. I wish I had Lumberjack I'd throw it in, but I don't, so we'll have to deal with it. Um, I'm going to start off with an early barrel, see what I can get against this guy again. Another level 10. Okay. From Dragon Nova. He's going to have an Executioner. And it's not going to throw and kill all of them, which is fine. Oh, it's going to be difficult with an Executioner, too. Uh, right now, I only have Squishy cards. So I'm going to play my Goblin Gang in the opposite lane to cycle to my Wizard. Oh, God. And I'm going to try and surround. That's not going to go great, but I have to take out the E-Barbs. That's actually going to work out. That's not going to be bad. I'm gonna, I'll take that. And then that's going to not get killed by that. I'll send my Miner over so we can get a little bit of damage. That worked out a lot better than I thought it would. I'm not going to lie to you. He's got an Electro Wizard. Dang it. We're going to get some chip shots off. That's okay. Good. Um, and I'm going to drop my minions on top of this Electro Wizard. Dang it. And now I need a Goblin Gang. He can zap my Goblin Gang away, but please don't. Please don't. That's good. He won't. And he's going to log it. Oh, that's great. He's going to log instead. I'm going to throw my barrel. Uh, I wish I'd thrown it a little bit earlier, but that's okay. Barrel there. What's he got for that? He's got another Executioner. He's trying a different plant. That plant's going to work a little bit better for him. Um, but we have managed to get some good chip damage. I have my wizard ready again. I imagine he'll come with elite barbs. And I'm still going to drop that Skarmy defense. Unless he's going to zap. And he's not going to come with elite barbs. That's fantastic news. Throw that a little bit off the side so he doesn't splash both my wizard and my tower. Um, and I'm going to come over here with my miner again. I'm, he might elite barbs this. Which I'm okay with. But I'm going to do... Ooh, he's going to do that. Okay. Uh, I'm going to drop my Skarmy over here. Come on over here. He's going to drop his Skarmy to counter mine. Uh, I'm going to log all this back because this Skarmy is going to come in and be super annoying. I am going to take some damage from this stupid Elite Barbarian, but it's only going to be one hit. I'm going to chuck another barrel. Oh, dang. He hogged. Uh, but that means I should get some good damage. So we're going to trade damage here. I'm going to drop my gang on top of this, hopefully clean up a little bit quicker. Nice. Yeah, still a little bit in the lead here. He's probably going to zap this or Electro Wizard it or log it. Oh, I thought he missed some things. And double elixir, um, so I'm going to do, okay, no I'm not, I'm going to do this and this, and this, stop, stop, don't touch the wizard, stop, don't touch the, ah, oh, you touched the wizard, uh, I'm going to have to log this, and maybe, I don't know, I don't, what am I supposed to do here, 
This is annoying. I don't really... Ah, what is the target? No! Turn around and... Oh, man, that's annoying. Okay, I'm going to do this. Throw a barrel over here. Get my miner. He's going to... He was over there. That's great. That means we'll probably be able to take out this tower. And we're back to square one. Even game again. Um, that's going to get cleaned up. He, this thing shouldn't do too much damage. I don't have to deal with this. Stop! <laughs> and he's going to E-bear over there. I'm going to do this. Drop my wizard in the middle. And then if he does zap that, I'm going to do the... Oh, dang. i do this. i got to log all this back. Logging out. And that's going to clean up that fairly nicely. Now we can get a little bit of a push going here. Uh, I'm hoping to be able to save up for my miner and my barrel. He's going to hopefully lock onto that miner first. He's going to eat with that. We're going to clean that up. Dang, that zap spell though. Ah. And we're going to chip that tower down just a little bit more. Um, Again, a little bit of trouble. I, I dislike how a zap spell will take. But he did just zap. He's going to he's gonna try and log it, but he's not going to guess right. Uh, I'm going to clean that up. No, no hits. Great. I'm going to do this. Drop my minions off to a little bit to the side. Um, I'm going to wait a little bit on the miner just because he's going to do that. I'm going to play that. I'm going to go deep with the barrel. I'm going to get ready to log. Dang it. Didn't have my log quite ready, but hopefully they will. Oh, he's going to zap. <laughs> Dang it. I hate that zap. Uh, I have my wizard ready again. We're just going to see if we can out cycle him now. Um, I'm going to send in my miner. Send in a barrel. Stop. Stop. I'm going to have my scrammy ready over here. Get out of here, he logs, so... Oh, we're going to get some nice chip damage! No! we're gonna, That's not bad. Ah, uh, and we're going to end the day with a tie. We're going to end that game with a tie. Not the day, just the game with a tie. That's annoying. So it's going to be a 1-1 draw, so a loss and a draw so far. But again, playing annoying decks with annoying splashy cards, but that's okay. We're going to play low 90. Low 90? Sure, why not? And he's level 9, so maybe it's a little bit fair of a fight. Um... I'm going to start with the wizard in the back. I don't really have anything great to pair with the miner. And we'll see what he does first. Just kind of react. We'll play a little bit more. Around. He's going to fire about that. Um, I will miner this if I can. Uh, ch -ch -ch -ch. He gives me a thumbs up because he thinks he's funny. I'm going to do this. And then I'm slowly going to do this. And we're just going to, we're, ooh, we're going to wait. Ooh, that's an old, Ah, dang. Is that well played? Are you being sarcastic? Shoot once. He's going to shoot once. He's twice. Nice. I'm going to drop my skyrim over here. I have my... Um, my gang ready in case he zaps. He's not going to zap. Ah, oh, not another executioner. It's a level one though. Uh, I'm gonna surround. I'm gonna wait till he comes in. I'm gonna surround. He's gonna throw that way. That's great. We're gonna clean that up. Nice and tidy. Excellent. And Sunbar up staying alive. He's got a Valkyrie. Oh my lord. I'm gonna barrel this. Hopefully this is gonna be able to clean this up. I will take the damage from this if I have to. What's he have for that? Doesn't have anything. He's gonna he's gonna fireball. That's fine because I got a lot more damage with the barrel. So there we go. A little bit of a lead here. Um. I'm gonna wait, gonna wait, gonna gonna play more of a reaction type of game um, than anything. But I will play if I get to ten, uh, and it looks like I'm gonna get to ten. So I'm just gonna drop a naked miner and see what I can get with this. And he's gonna drop a skarmy. So I'm gonna arrow this because I don't, I haven't seen a need for anything else with my arrow. So I'm gonna do that. I have a message here somewhere. Um, excuse me, I'm trying to record. I did put Do Not Disturb on, I swear, but he's going to drop Elite Barbs. I'm going to come with my minions in the back. Maybe he'll fireball that. Uh, he's going to go with Executioner, but they'll, they'll race a little bit ahead. And I'm going to drop a Wizard up in the corner here, and those minions are going to help clean that up. Uh, nice. Uh, and if I have to, I can Goblin Gang this if he decides to fireball, or if not, um, that's okay too. Uh, and then I'm going to come with a Miner, and I'm going to come with a Barrel, and I'm going to come with Prediction Arrows. Prediction Arrows are extremely risky. Oh, he's going to firebots. That's a good value firebots. Well played by him. Um, again, with that amount of stuff that I threw at the tower, that's pretty much the right decision. Uh, just a barrel alone would have justified it, but a miner and a barrel definitely justified. So that's well played by him. I didn't tell him that because he's kind of being mean. Uh, he's going to elite barb over there. I'm going to drop this. He's going to execution. I'm going to do these. And if I have to, I will drop a skarmy in the corner here. And we're going to drop a skarmy in the corner. Oh, he's going to graveyard me. I'm going to have to defensive miner. This is going to be interesting. Um, but, uh, no, 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 Oh, we're getting overwhelmed. Got a log, got a log, got a log. Log, and we're going to suffer a nice amount of damage. That's great. That's hilarious. I find that super funny as well. Um, I'm going to throw a barrel over here. I don't know if I like, oh, dang. No, 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 no. I'm going to arrow all this, and he's probably going to take out our tower. Uh, I'm going to have to log this thing away. No, no, no. Shut the heck up. And we're going to lose to a Graveyard Surprise deck. So that is a bit annoying. Uh, dang it! Moving to 0-2 on the day. 
Good game. I'm ignoring you. You're being rude. <sighs> oh, and two. Wow. I've never lost this deck. I've lost twice. All right. Well, hopefully I can clean this up a little bit more. Otherwise, I don't know what I'm going to do, but whatever. All right. We're just going to go for it. We're going to keep constant pressure. Goblin gang, goblin bear. Oh, I see. I'm going to log this. And he's going to zap those, so I'm going to get some damage to the barrel. Great start. I've definitely spent a lot more licks than he has, but if he doesn't push me, that'd be fantastic. Playing, I don't know how to say that. I don't even know what language that is. I'm going to guess Chinese, but Mandarin. Um, all right, now we're going to relax, because I know he's probably sitting at 10 already, because he didn't spend as much elixir as I did on those two. There it is. Uh, mm, I'm going to try and do a nice little split up here. Come, turn, 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 turn. There, he's going to turn over there. That's not bad. Just a little bit of delay the skeletons gave me kind of is going to let me stay a little bit more. Oh, alive. Uh, and that was is gonna get that wizard. That prince thing is gonna get some damage after he chips my wizard. He's gonna drop an electro wizard. Dang it! Does everybody have the electro wizard except for me? I love the electro wizard. Uh, but that's okay. We added another. I don't even have that abandoned on my main account, so that's a pretty good add. I'm not gonna lie. I'm super happy about that. He's gonna zap all that away. Man, I need to get my goblin gang up. Um, I'm gonna send in a miner and some minions. See what he has to deal with it. Um, the time is a little off, but he has to now make a decision. He's going to go with that, so I'm going to get the miner chipped in. Ooh, and we're going to get some nice damage on everything else. Nice, that miner did absolute work. And that Mega Minion's at a health level where we can take it out. I'm going to get ready to air all this. He's throwing kind of deeper right here. And we are going to be able to take that out. Nice, no damage suffered on that tower yet. Pretty good playing. Um... I might wait if he doesn't play anything. I don't want him to use his Electro Wizard on this because I can't really deep barrel because his Electro, Electro Wizard will stun everything before it gets a tower. But we're going to barrel anyways. Um, and Oh, Valkyrie. I like the Valkyrie more. I'm going to get more damage off by that. I mean, so I'm going to start my Wizard in the back to deal with this Valkyrie. Um, I imagine he'll probably come Prince again because he had success with that. He's going to go Prince opposite lane, which is interesting. If he does zap that, I'll play my uh, gang. He is going to zap that, I'll play my gang. Uh, and that should clean up that prince very nicely, if not distract it long enough. And that means I can start to push over here with my miner. Um, he's going to drop his musketeer, and that's going to be distracted. Wait, was that sh what was shooting at my friggin' wizard? And I'm going to log. I don't know why I logged that, but I logged it anyways. I'm going to do this over here. No, no, I'm not. No, oh, okay, that's a little bit late. That extra bit of damage isn't going to matter anyways, because my um, he, my mega is gonna get my mega is gonna one hit those. My mega, his mega. Oops, my bad. I'm gonna drop another. No, 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 no. Back, 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 back. And that's actually gonna chip that out. Nice. And then I have my other goblin gang to deal with the musketeer. Although it's not gonna need to be dealt with. I'm gonna arrow all this Shazam, and he's gonna get no damage. And I'm gonna come at him with an arrow and a log. Oh, disappearing log. And he's gonna valk. Oh, I would have pushed him. No, I wouldn't have. I got a little bit of damage there. I have my arrows. I can probably cycle quick enough. I mean, if he plays anything kind of aggressive, I'm going to expose him with the miner. Um, and that's kind of there. We got some good damage there. I'm going to arrow because I think I can pull this off. That's going to be annoying. I might need to drop. I'm going to need to defend this. But he, oh, he played. Oh, what the heck? He had to waste a lot of elixir on that one, though. I'm going to log all this back. Thanks. Shut up. And I'm going to play in another miner. And this should hopefully be game with the, some arrows because all he needs is one hit. And that's going to be a good game for our first win of the day. Nice. That's usually how my other games went, but whatever. All right, one more. Hopefully we can end on a win. Gold chest there. Not bad. Um, so, yeah, we're going to see if we can get one more win and a crown chest, and that would be a fantastic end to the day. Kind of pull it back. Two, we're one, two, and one, which is a very symmetrical number, but not a number I'm happy with. Um, but, again, pumped about that bandit. So, yay, legendary chest. I did not think I had the level to get that, but. I never really checked, honestly. Uh, I'm going to clean these skeletons up with my log. And, oh, we're dealing with the balloon deck, so I'm going to drop my minions. He's going to play a hog in the opposite lane. That means he shouldn't have elixir to zap or anything like that. Hopefully, don't zap me. And I'm going to hopefully play my miner. That should protect one of them, hopefully. No, it's not going to protect any of them, but whatever. Got a little bit of hits off. I do have a skarmy rushing the other lane, so I'm going to get some good damage with that miner. And we're going to chip a little bit with the skarmy, which is great. Um, so overall, not a bad start. Again, a hog balloon deck seems like a weird pairing, but we'll deal with it. Uh, I'm gonna gang the middle of this. As be, ooh, I'm gonna actually arrow and then gang. Oh no! Oh, what the heck? He's a level nine with level eleven minions. Oh my lord! Oh wow. Okay. Well, memo to self: don't arrow those. We're gonna have to drop our wizard. So that means I'm gonna have to save my wizard just for those minions. Um, well, it kind of means that if he does drop a Skyrim with this, I'm just going to do a prediction arrow next time. Uh, I will log this back, because I don't really have a use for my log right now. Oh, nice, Elite Barb. Caught the Elite Barbs on the way through. 
Uh, no Batara, thanks. So, dude, uh, I'm gonna scar me those. Clean those up. I'm gonna drop a miner. Maybe I can tank. No, 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 no. I should be able to tank for some of them. There we go. He's gonna look over there. And he's not gonna get the skeletons. And those skeletons are gonna go to town on the tower. And not take it up. That's pretty good. Um, I'm gonna drop my minions because I don't really have anything else. I'm also gonna drop my gang. Uh, he did fireball, so hopefully he won't have too much to be able to do with that. Still save my wizard here. Is he gonna zap that? Nope. Oh, I should have played my barrel, but okay. There we go. We got a lot. Of oh, I'm gonna play my wizard. That should clean those. What? Why is it only hitting one? Come on, wizard. Harry, you're a wizard. Come on, wizard. Uh, I'm gonna play a barrel here, so he has to deal with that. Prediction arrows. Nice prediction arrows, and I'm gonna get some hits off on that. And oh, he's gonna chip it down to five. That's annoying, but we're gonna take out the balloon. Uh, he's gonna play his mu musketeer. I'm not gonna be able to take it out, but I'm gonna log it and then take the tower. Meanwhile, I'll drop my scary to defend against a hog. Um, I can send a miner over to the other side if I want to. I'll send a barrel over and then a miner deep to the king tower. Oh, he's gonna do that. I'm gonna save my wizard and play a little bit slower. Just need one hit. Got it over there. Now, wizard's gonna go over here. Uh, minions to the far side. He's gonna play a prediction fireball. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, shoot. I'm going to play a distraction Skyrim, and I can't arrow that. It doesn't really matter. I mean, at this point, the game is pretty much over with 17 seconds left. Unless he can 3-cram me, which maybe, but, like, I'm going to drop a defensive miner. His balloon might do a little bit of work. I'm kind of scared of this balloon. Let's drop something. But I can't really see this ending. Um, but there we go. We're going to take it. 2-1 uh, to to victory. A nice way to end the day, I tell you. Um... I don't know why I had no... Okay, eat my log. That's a nice name. I didn't notice that. <laughs> From Palestine. So there we go. We're going to move to 2, 2, and 1, which is not a bad day to end, bad way to end the game. Uh, but, more importantly, look at this new babe. Nice bandit. We're going to do a bandit video. I'm going to find a nice bandit deck, hopefully. And that's basically going to be it for today. Again, minor deck works pretty well. I did have two losses, but I also won two games at the end. And you can kind of see how I can really cycle people down and do a lot of damage. Just a lot to have to deal with, which is really annoying. Um, but before I go, for the viewers, I'm going to open this chest here. Oh, I got a Dark Goblin. I actually like the Dark Goblin. I might level him up. Um, that's just basically going to be it for today. Uh, again, the minor focus deck. Minor was deck was a focus of today. Um, and I will bring you some bandit gameplay in the future, but probably after this weekend, because I do have, there is the heal draft challenge coming, and I'm going to do that. Um, so that's probably the next video I'll post. Then after that, a bandit video. Um, but if you're still here, I'd just like to thank you very much for watching, and remind you to keep calm and clash on, my friends. Peace.